Yo, what is everybody? We are back for episode six of Flower of Evil. Last episode, they killed off the main character. That's crazy to me. Game of Thrones level, just subversion of expectations. Um, did not know that that was gonna happen, but it appears that his sister is the real killer. And now we just need to figure out how we're gonna get to that point. We lost Detective Choi, and we also lost, um, uh, and we also lost Hyun Su in one episode. We still gotta deal with his fake parents, his sister. Was his dad even a serial killer at all? Did he just kill himself because he found out that it was his daughter? There's lots of stuff that, that needs to be explored that hasn't been. So let's see where we go and how this show develops. We're gonna go ahead and jump into episode six. Oh, it's a flashback. Oh, and that's what he hit him. Damn. Yeah. But he wasn't even texting, bro. He just wasn't watching the road. Okay. But how did he end up in the hospital? That's what I'm trying to figure out. That didn't go how my brain perceived it to go. No! That's suspect to me. I'm leaving you there, bro. So wait, is it the reverse? What do you, I'm sure what do you, um, wait, wait. Stop. Stop. Are they gonna bring him back? That's what I'm saying, stop. Yeah, okay. she she definitely has something to do with that situation. Yeah, they brought him back. Wow. So you technically weren't wrong. He technically did die. No, this is the flashback. This is the flashback. What, they just what, what? they just tricked the fuck out of us. What when he got hit? Then we got hit. I'm not falling for that shit. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Watch this. It's still gonna be a parallel though. Yeah, see his legs is fucked up. Ow. Ah, uh, they did a good job trying to trick me. Very clever. Plus his wife would have been right there. It says patient Baki song on the door. They're still trying to trick you. Yeah. Okay, I was like, why is this man so confused? But it's because he thought he's just hallucinating. Mm-hmm. Don't don't worry, they're not they they're not tricking me with this shit. What are you talking about? Oh what? Wait. What? Okay. No, this is definitely. Yeah, present. this is now. All right. Wow. He was like in a coma or something, cause he was out for. Yeah, his for legs wasn't working. Okay, I got tricked. What the fuck? No, you didn't get tricked. You just <laughs> you were trying to not get tricked <laughs> and <laughs> tricked yourself. <laughs> I broke my old ankles. Yeah, he's married. I think the trick, well, I think they were trying to trick you into thinking that this is when he got hit by the car because he couldn't walk. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah. Yeah, brought this nigga back with Disney magic. What do you mean it's a hospital? Was it Disney magic? He was dead for like 30 minutes. How do you know it was 30 minutes? It could have been five. The hospital could have been It right took her 20 to get him out of the water. It could have been five. <laughs> She's like hoping to hear. They were hoping that he died. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's been 10 days. Suffering from cardiac arrest. 
So he died for eight minutes. Oh boy. Oh no! Is he trolling? Oh, oh okay. I, yeah. Yeah, he's trolling. You're an asshole. Yeah, that was not even a way to kid with her. <laughs> well, I mean, it definitely wasn't their motive to keep him dead because then they would have interfered and, like, sabotaged his survival. She's still like, we gotta have a conversation, bro. She don't like that bitch. Yep. His, her mom is right. Yeah, that's what I said. She, you could tell that they don't like each other. Oh. And she's also like, I don't want you a holding this person because I don't know who the F that is. <laughs> Oh, wow. As in dead. What happened to your son? Oh, he's still alive. What? That actually sucks. He is a piece of. He, he was a piece of trash, but it still sucks. They're doing something to him. Sure, there's a chunk of his head gone. They said a fractured skull. That makes sense though that you'd be like that because mm -hmm. it's like you would be shaken up from the situation and you could make yeah. it look like but that's not why she actually wants her to stay. Yeah. But you could make it look like that's the reason. She's so cute. Oh, Mm. None of your business. No. 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 Especially because you came in here yelling at me like it was a who do you think you are? Oh. Oh, she attacked her son. <clears throat> she may not have attacked him, but it it's probably her fault. Partly. Because of her temper. Either he got into an accident because they had a fight, or like she caused him bodily harm or something. I don't know. Oh, this is when they first brought him mm -hmm. there. Mm. He's like, ma'am, it could be months, and you already breaking down after just five days. Damn, that's a that free run shit. It's only been a mere five days. Oh, he's still pretending like he can't. He's unresponsive. Oh, he had cancer. Bro. But he's aware. 
그렇다는 건 우리도 오늘 밤 안에 뭔가를 해야 한다는 뜻이네요. But if he's unresponsive, I mean. But they, they don't no, know if he's just pretending. Ain't no way that ain't no way that nigga pretending. 언제 심장마비를 일으켜도 이상하지 않은 상태야. 난 도울 수 있다. They gonna get this nigga a heart attack in his hospital bed. 직접은 못 하시고요. He's like, I don't want that blood on my hands. This is the Diddy meme. The Diddy <laughs> yeah. The dude. Them two looking at each other. Him being the light skinned dude. He's like, I don't. <laughs> he's like, I don't know if I'm trying to be a a murderer, dog. Wow, that was smart of him. Mm -hmm. Just in case, yeah. <laughs> he told him what he told her that he went with him. Yeah. What the f- She got interfered with. Yeah, they probably like threatened. Somebody threatened her. But she was the one that was at the hotel that saw the license plate and gave it to them. Yeah, um, that's why. Yep, there it is. Oh, uh, I didn't mean, uh, yeah. Yep. Oh. Do you think he was testing the waters to see if she would? Flinch? No, she literally has something in her hair. <laughs> so was he barely conscious? I think he was. He probably drove. Oh! Oh! Oh, thank God. You know, you scared me. Oh my gosh. Yo, shout out to the Disney magic that saved literally everybody's life. Nobody died. I told you, I was optimistic. Damn, right to the juicy questions. Wasted no he time. Somebody else. Torture me to try to get information. I mean, that's easy to skirt around. She's also trying to protect him. I know, but he could have been like, oh, he didn't have no questions for me. He just said he was torturing me for fun. He said he enjoyed it. She's like, well, you've been lying to me this long, so you're probably good. But what was the nail in the coffin, I think, for her was when she called his name over the fence. And then, like, he looked. And then he, I don't know, he he doesn't know she still has his watch. That like, she found it at that other Yeah, seat. he doesn't know. That's why he has an alibi for the one thing, but not the other. I don't know if she's brought that up. But no, he does have an alibi for that. The alibi was that he was with the reporter. He was with the reporter. But then how did? But actually, no. The watching the warehouse. warehouse. Yeah, you're right. And she chased him, and he ran yeah. from her. Like it's cooked. <laughs> <laughs> You're incredible, bro. <laughs> it's like, bro, that's real yeah. convenient. I respect Detective Choi, man. So, I know. Ooh. Damn. 
정주영 사과드리겠습니다. He wants to plant doubt in the other cops' minds. Yeah. Like he has a vendetta. 거짓말을 했거나 앞으로 할 거거나 저한테 지극히 개인적인 편견을 가진 상태에서 제 진술 조서를 담당하고 계신 거군요. Yo. It's funny because his instinct, he does have like the animal instinct. If he said he was despicable or whatever. He's like, well, you just further prove my point. I'll be leaving. <laughs> yeah, but. <laughs> but I feel like if anything, he just put the battery and choice back to investigate him even more. Yeah, that too. Because he pissed him off. Yeah. She met with him. She met with um, Hyun Soo. Oh, okay. I thought she was good. Mm. What is that? Damn, she's trying to. She's she a real one. She's trying to help him mm -hmm. cover that shit up. Until she figures out what's going on. She's like questioning her own actions, like, why am I doing this? Yeah. The metal works. So, is that the warehouse that was in the camcorder video? When he was like hiding what he saw down there? Did he see a cage down there and didn't say mm. anything because he had a crush on Homegirl? I don't know. So, no, yeah, his dad did have a big ass fucking cage down there. Okay. Well, they said that's just in the father's workshop. What if he didn't know that was down there? Yeah, a cage. So then they would have had to have been in cahoots, but... Yeah. Oh, he's, he's gonna kill him. But it's like, he can clearly see there's something wrong, like... Yeah, she's about to confront me. Yeah. You don't trust me? Damn, she's playing it up. Oh, yeah, she is. Never mind. I thought she was about to confront him, too. Yeah. She's really talking about the situation. Oh. So she did kind of confront yeah. him in a way. Yeah. Damn. She just hope she wants him to come clean and just be honest with her without her having to like use her job training to like pull it out of him. Because mm -hmm. she's facing like a double whammy. Like not only did he lie, but he didn't trust me with whatever it is. <laughs> Oh, my sister. Oh, my God. Don't. Oh, my God. And that confirmed it even more. <laughs> Come looking for me, is what he said. Mm. But it pretty much just confirmed what she already knew. Yeah. Can you imagine if there was other niggas in the room when he said that? 정말 미안해. 근데 이런 식으로 현장에 자꾸 기자들 숨어들면 우리가 일이 안 돼. 알잖아. 그래도 고맙습니다. Why does nigga like Detective Troy with a wig on? 미안하다고 해주셔서. 
그런 사람이 어딨어? 어. 어, 맞아. 너 보면 네 아버지 생각나. 소름 끼쳐. 와우. 많아요. 저 그렇게 뻔뻔하고 몰상식한 사람 아닙니다. Maybe she's not a serial killer. Maybe she yeah, found out what her dad was doing and clapped him. And then maybe the whole car thing was like she was a witness or something to something. And then. Nah. <laughs> Damn, she she got him ready. <laughs> Damn, she got him to fuck all the way off. <laughs> She's considering it. Oh, his fake father. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. They're gonna go try and murder this dude in his bed. Yep. So dude, homeboy's like, yo. What you doing? Mm -hmm. Why is she taking a moment on hydrogen peroxide? And then she's gonna look and see. Threw a puppy into a well. Extreme violence towards animals. Lack of expression, indifference, which she knows that stuff. Mm -hmm. Needs to be administered psychiatric medication. Okay, so yeah, the village head was taking care of them in their father's place, and he probably was doing, he might have done something to the sister. Yeah. She's going into the basement. And she's going to use that, I think, the black light to look for blood. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah, I'm a doctor. I mean, she shouldn't find nothing down there. She has the chemical solution. She's trying to find blood. Oh, yeah, true. I hope she's about to see that blood down there. But he would have cleaned, he would have cleaned it up. They fought down there forever ago. But a black light can still pick it up depending on what you cleaned it up with. He's gonna show him what to administer. Yeah, because they're gonna look for those. So he's gonna just put it in his IV. Yeah, he didn't have to. Damn, she bought the CSI this nigga's workshop. I was about to say, why are you on no cops watching his? But he does. Wow, because he's always asleep. And he doesn't or know wait. what doctor or whatever comes in there. Yeah, he's normally asleep. Is he pretending? Yes. Wait. He knew it was going to be a matter of time before they came in there. He going to grab the F out of his head. What do you think you're doing? If this thing has been pretending, though, W. But, I mean, How do you that just side pretend? of him is handcuffed to the bed, so, I mean, he is pretending. This is Cap. Sir? Because they said all of his organs are normal, so they're like his. They, yeah, uh, like I said, that does that is, that makes yeah, sense. Yeah, W nigga, bro. Because they literally said all his organs is normal. We don't understand why he's unresponsive. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking dead. Wow, bro. You know what I would have did? <laughs> he's the but. <laughs> he's he's been waiting for him to come <laughs> kill him. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't get that close to him. What if he decided to bite some off? I feel like he's not going to kill him. I think in order to prove that, because he's like, how can I prove to you that I'm not a liar? Yeah. I think the only way he can prove that is literally by not killing him. Yeah. Oh, well. But he, I mean... Yeah. When he was saying that stuff to him in the pool. He's about to have a heart attack. Yeah, he's about to have a heart attack. Because he said, I wonder what it's going to do to you. When he told, told him, like, he's not going to get anything out of him from the torture. Oh, I thought he was just going to have a natural heart attack because the, the other guy said he could have a heart attack. 
I hope he put in IV. It's done. He's not gonna do it. Oh, he just put in the syringe. Yeah, he, he not built like that. He's not gonna do it. He's not gonna do it. Yep, there it is. Damn. All the zip ties. Damn. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Alright, stop the cap. Stop the cap. Thank you. You're not built like that. Uh oh. That struck a nerve. Oh, wow. He doesn't understand the emotions. Yeah. He doesn't understand the emotions. This cop smoking the whole box of cigarettes. Well, you still gotta go, bro. You still butchered an innocent man. Yeah, he's a very logical person, so that seems illogical to him. That's sad, man. Yeah, because she's the only victim where they don't know where she mm -hmm. is. I hope they find her before the show is over. I do too. But I think he's gonna go confront his sister and try to figure out where, her, where the body is. Oh, wait. Oh, no, he's actually doing it. Oh, never mind. Well, yeah, he's still, I mean, he still had to go. Oh, oh shit. No. Oh, now he can it's too late. He already left. See, he's already back in his patient clothes. But don't the hospital they got, got cameras, cameras, nigga. They, all right. Yeah, he didn't do it. He didn't do it. He didn't. He didn't give him what the guy gave him. He probably just put some water in there. So what did he tell him? You would have never believed me. So somebody gave it to her and she gave it to him. Mm. Or he thinks somebody... <laughs> Yeah, you better find her. Because he's like, you already wasted so much time. Yeah. I knew you wouldn't kill him. Oh. He closed it. Wow. Because I'm not a killer. And you're the only one that can tell them why you tortured me. Yeah, he needs him to like kind of. Yeah, so name. even if there's cameras, it doesn't matter because he didn't do nothing to him. So he's just back to acting. And she's getting cooked by everything else too, just like that guy did. But it doesn't make sense because in his reports when he was a kid, it's like he doesn't have emotion, he doesn't have this, but he clearly does like when it comes to his kid and his wife. But remember, we also seen him watching videos and practicing how to do True. all that shit. But sometimes, remember, he smiled and surprised yeah. himself, so it's not like he's incapable. It just doesn't come as naturally to him. Oh, okay. Well, dang. He just realized, finally. I was like, when is this guy gonna realize that his watch is Ooh. not on him? Oh, she showed up. She's gonna tell them what she saw. I hope nothing happens to her daughter. Oh, come on, this is about to get juicy as fuck. <laughs> Her. Oh, she. Who was that putting her in the car? I don't know, that looked like a dude. It was a dude. Oh, 
하지만 나중에는 진술을 완전히 뒤집습니다. Yeah, it's probably like something saying. Oh, it's like a. It's like a threat. It's a message. Yeah. 말씀해 주시겠어요? 그때 당시. 재밌었어요. Go back to the message, bro. Come on. What? I'm going with egg tart on this one because it looks like a cloud. <laughs> yeah, it looks just like a cloud. Oh, okay. We have two mysteries. Is this about to unfold? What's in the bag? Because we still don't know who was. Well, yeah, that was because we still technically don't know who was calling dude on his phone. We don't know if that was a taxi driver calling the guy. It was. Oh, wait. It was definitely the taxi driver calling him, by the way. And threatening him yeah. That's definitely a voice, di a voice distortion. Oh. Hold up. It was all rumors. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why I was like, that wouldn't make sense to her. Yeah, like what yeah. he said about her. She doesn't believe in what she hears. She only believes in what, what she, she sees. sees. Hang on, we going back to that real quick. Because the timeline is throwing me off. Because she gave her what? The tape? In the bag? Because what was in the bag? Um, in the bag, it was a, um, it, it looked like another tape? Like another, like, it's like, like a, a voicemail or maybe. something. But, yeah, yeah it's, it's like a voice recorder. Voice recorded message. It's probably the same person on that recorder as it is on the other one that threatened the but, woman. But that's not what I'm talking about. The voice recorder left a message saying, did you hear about the village chief death? But the village chief took them in after their father died. So obviously it has to be his sister. Mm -hmm. So that's what I was gonna, I'm just a little bit, I, I might have missed a detail no, on no, when that, she got no. the, when did she actually get that message? Because like they, because at the time when, um, when that happened, when the dude's wife was taken, the alibi was that Hyunsu and his dad were at the workshop. Mm -hmm when that happened that was the alibi so yes. when did she get this message like how soon after were they let me see what did she say she said she had an answering machine at i know but did she give like a, a time frame no she didn't she just said that they left a message on and and it was 18 years ago that she did say yeah but but that's but i'm just confused but i understand the, what you're saying you're saying what saying i'm saying that, so okay let's figure this out so the chief took them in after the father was killed after he took himself out the chief took them in the and dad must have took himself out right after him and his son were together after those two days he took himself out the chief took him in the chief found out something that same killer that kidnapped homegirl um 
probably the chief knew something or was looking into it or something and then clapped the chief. I don't I don't know. Y'all gotta clear that up for it me. It had to have it had to all have happened like unless like she just didn't say nothing about what she saw for a long time until after he took himself out. Because everything came out after he took himself out. After he killed himself is when everything came out. And then maybe that's when they looked into it and she was like, Oh yeah, I did see. But no. Because he would have reported his wife. I well, don't because know. because the alibi. The alibi is what saved the dad. Yeah, I don't. So I don't. that's what I'm saying. The only thing that <clears throat> would that would make sense if everyone is telling the quote unquote truth. If everyone is telling the truth, then it would literally have to mean that the dad took himself out right at, right at the same time when that chick got kidnapped. Yeah, so I don't know. I don't know. Y'all could clear. Y'all could clear that one up. That one. That that one threw me for a loop because I'm like, okay, yeah, it's clearly his sister using a voice changer. But when we saw the clip, it looked like a whole nigga throwing her in the car. So I'm also confused about that. Or you know. But the village chief, the village chief, got clapped. Yeah. So it had to have literally been that chick got kicked because she was the last victim 18 years ago. So mm -hmm. that chick got kidnapped by whoever the killer is then killer after they um kidnapped her um they the dad killed himself quote unquote then after the dad killed himself because she wanted to line she wanted to um free herself of being of uh, being guilty of the bodies so she probably um so homegirl got grabbed then the dad died right after dur but let me, know, tell you right after. That, let me tell you why that doesn't make any sense because they stayed with the village chief for a while and they tortured the hell but out do we of know he stayed with the village we chief do probably. because they were fucking with him those are the rumors they were performing all kinds of sh r rituals and shit and do we saw all that happen to him we seen that we just don't know how much t how long that's what that i'm was saying that that's what i'm saying when did she get when did she actually get that message yeah i don't know that's why I'm saying, like, none of that could have happened within the span of three days. That's where my confusion is coming in. So, and she was like, oh, the village chief died because he was, because he was nosy. And who do we, who do we keep seeing in the flashback with the village chief? We keep seeing him and, and her. Yeah. So, hey, it is what it is. This show is really good. I'm fully invested in what the hell is going on right now. And I need to, I, I, I need more. But shout out to G1 for, for, she's supporting him. It's making her really uncomfortable, but she's giving him the benefit of the doubt. And I respect it. I just think that it's hard for her because she's trying to, like, it's still in a sense, like, you know, a grieving for her. Cause mm -hmm. she like, doesn't know who this person technically is. Then like, she does believe you know i think in her mind she already understands like okay he assumed a different identity because they all thought that he was this other person and i don't think he was that other person because no evidence supports that y'all are just believing rumors and so she's like okay well let me find out what's actually concrete she's like because everything that y'all are like saying to be fact is just a bunch of rumors so i think at this point she doesn't think that he has his father's tendencies that's why she was defending him mm -hmm. as far as his character traits that are good um but i think that she's more so mad like okay i think it's like a half and half like he she's mad that he couldn't be honest with her on top of the fact that um like she she also like resonates with why he did what he did because like all these people are terrible when it comes to like looking at evidence and not just like believing what you hear yeah they're just judging him based on what they heard but listen he's not built like that he's not a killer but he's calculated and i respect that and he's just basically he let dude go he was like hey you did me a solid i'm gonna do you a solid so and the fact that is. he actually even remembered the watch and because i feel like if he was truly like a careless person like if he didn't care he would have forgot about the watch and just not even remembered it but the fact that it was like a gift from his wife to him I, I think that's why it eventually dawned on him that he didn't even have it anymore yeah well 
I guess we're gonna see how this goes. This timeline shit is folding my brain. I gotta figure out what the hell is going on, but they'll probably clear it up some more next episode. So that's gonna be it for episode six and on to the next. As always, like, subscribe, follow on all socials, at bro, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, subscribe, sure. Links down below. Check out the merch link that's also down below. That's all we got for you guys today. Hope you have a great day and we'll catch you guys next time. Peace.